Hey, man. Yo, DJ Weird, bring it down, man. Yo, I got the casting director, man, with the host, with the most, man. She got some of the baddest chicks I've ever seen in my life. Ooh. You know, uh, yeah. yo, it, it ain't too much I can say about her, man. She's a, a ball of fun. I go to her functions, and, um, yeah, she really be putting on. And uh, it was one night I went, I'll tell y'all about it in a minute. Without further ado, y'all give it up for Molly World Casting. Hey. Okay. <laughs> Molly, what's up, baby? What's up? How are you? I'm good. I'm, I'm so happy to have you here today. Oh, thank you. I feel honored. I appreciate you. I'm, I'm, I'm a really big fan of yours. Oh, really? I'm a big fan of you. Yeah, I'm a really big fan of yours, man. Like, yo, you got a lot of class. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, 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 man. Hey, yo, you, you, you brought some, you brought some bad mama jammas with you today. Yes. I know y'all, y'all too, <laughs> too young for what mama jammas. I know <laughs> head with that old school. Yeah, y'all some bad mama jammas. Who, who are these people? Y'all introduce yourselves. Hi, I'm Davina Sinclair. Got a fine girl name. <laughs> Davina Sinclair. No, that ain't her real name. <laughs> <laughs> name Wait, is it your real name? Ashley Jenkins. <laughs> She's like, yeah, my name. <laughs> name is Kelly Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my name is Desi Ann, all the way from Brooklyn. You feel okay. me? Then yeah. I, I believe her. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like a real nigga name. <laughs> <laughs> my name is Michaela Sales, and I'm from Maryland. Okay, yeah, that sounds like a real nigga name. Too. <laughs> I just happen to know a Michaela from uh, Maryland too. That's okay. okay, wait, yeah. where are you from? Here, Georgia. Okay, Georgia, yeah. but you're Nigerian, are you? Yeah. Okay. Nigeria. Yeah. She's from Nigeria, Georgia. Well, no, she's not Nigeria, Georgia. She's from Georgia. <laughs> she's from Georgia. <laughs> Nigeria, but ethnically Nigerian. So. Yeah. Okay. I can dig it. I can tell by your hair. There you go. You. Yeah, you guess she got that. You got that good hair. <laughs> I uh, I hugged her earlier and when I got some of it in my mouth, I was like, that's, 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 that's Nigerian right here. Yeah, so, uh, yo, Molly, man, yo, put, put me on, man. How you even get started with all this, man, at 27 years old, Facts. so accomplished? You know, um, I actually started on YouTube um, making my own videos. I would act like I was the artist, and I would direct, shoot, edit myself, and then be in the videos. And then a couple of years later, some rappers found me and they wanted me to start shooting their videos. So I, that's how I got into the whole hip hop world and getting paid to direct videos and everything. And then that was, I was like 17 at the time, 18. And then at and night- that worked. Yeah, I mean, I was getting paid shit, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep, and then at 19, I started casting because my business partner, Show Out, who owns So Official, um, wanted me to be the face of his company. And he wanted me to start helping him with directing and also casting as well. And then it just blew up from there at 19 years old. So, yeah, now I'm 27. Man, I'm mm. so impressed <laughs> with you, man. <laughs> hey, let, let, let me tell you something that Molly did one night to me. Oh, goodness. So I'm There's at, no I'm, telling. I'm, I'm, at the, uh, <laughs> I'm at, a, a, at the projects, man. I told Cle my boy. Oh, Clay. yeah, Clay. Shout out to Clay. Yeah, yeah. The projects is comedy night in Atlanta mm -hmm. on Tuesdays. And, you know what I'm saying? I'm over here going to the spot and everything. I'm finna just go on stage. You know, I'm finna just do a little time real quick, work some jokes out. And it's this fine ass, big booty, big titty <laughs> shit come up to me and shit. And she just rub my head and sit on my lap and whatnot. And she was like, hey, Jack, what's going on? How you doing? You don't remember me, do you? I said, no, but it don't matter, man. Like, I know, I know your ass now. Um, she, she told me, she told me the name. Yes, yeah, so Molly sent me over here. I said, Molly who? She said, Molly World Casting. I said, who the fuck is Molly World Casting? <laughs> and, um, cause I, the name was so familiar to me mm -hmm. and whatnot. And then, and, and um, what was crazy, she like, you know, you met her in New York and some shit like that, mm -hmm. and your name was already in my phone or something. Like, <laughs> I, I don't know how this even even happened, but this I, I, I was so I, I, I think I was so lit at the same time. <laughs> I ain't even really pay attention to what was going on because mm -hmm. I was like, yo, I gotta get this girl home with me right here. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy I, I might have been on my 
like third double shot of Remy Martin. Oh, hell no, Remy. Yes, Remy uh, Martin. Uh. And um, I was on a, a Dos Equis, a Dos Equis beer. That's my thing right there. Remy Martin, Dos That's Equis. a lot together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's old nigga alcoholic shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I feel it. I feel it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Erica Dutchess, she had made a little joke about me and shit and stuff. Like I that. love Erica. Yeah, yeah. So your, your homegirl was sitting on my lap mm-hmm. and whatnot. And um, uh, 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 her, she put your number in my phone instead of her number. <laughs> As a smart girl should. Yeah. <laughs> and to this day, I'm still looking for this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we can look through. We can look through my roster. <laughs> it, it, I, I couldn't point out in the lineup. Oh damn! But, oh, you remember that booty though? Right. <laughs> <laughs> this was so fine. <laughs> she was so fine. But after that, I just started seeing you everywhere. Mm-hmm. I remember seeing you everywhere too. Yeah. <laughs> we kept bumping each other. I'm like, oh, Jack's here. Okay. Yeah. That's when you know it's official. <laughs> yeah, you, for sure. <laughs> I, I, I seen the, I, the next time I seen you. Was that um, uh, 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 the shit show? Yeah, the shit show. Yeah. And you had a VIP. You had mm-hmm. about 30 girls. About 30 with girls you. with me. Mm hmm. Man, the normal. everybody was fine. <laughs> everybody was fine that day. For sure. We were all laughing our asses off, too. You had a good time? Yeah, we had a great time. Yes. Yeah, the shit show. I right? love the shit show. They always give me, you know, tickets and everything to make sure we vibe out and have a good time. Man, I was over there drinking all my liquor. No, you were. <laughs> It was okay though. I yeah. sure I, I fuck with you, so you can. You was so hospitable, <laughs> and Thank I thought you. I was being slick and whatnot, and I was just making conversation. And you, you mind if I? <laughs> okay, cool. Man, you came over with the camera and stuff too. I, I was over there with the camera. Yeah. I'm mm-hmm. like, hey man, keep put, keep talking to mommy. <laughs> yep. <laughs> you trying to do the those drinks? I was watching you drink my shit. It's okay. I, yeah. And you know I that song. There. In my section, drinking my shit, yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? With the girl with the jugs <laughs> and all that. <laughs> Girls with the booties and this. And we have all shapes and sizes, too. All shapes and sizes. The petite you know? girls. All ethnicities. On point. All different nationalities. Yeah. One nation under a groove. <laughs> getting down just for the funk of it. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Yo, yeah, where you find these girls at, man? You Yo. Need to, you need to start your own dating app. <laughs> you know what? Men ask me all the time for a new girlfriend. Like, I should do a dating show or something. I, I mean, I, hey, listen. Or an app. I'm, you want to host it? No, I was just going to ask you to hook me up with about five girls. Oh. I, I got a one bedroom apartment. <laughs> oh, well, I can introduce them, but you got to finish the rest. I, I can just, yeah, I can't introduce you because I don't. I don't. Pimp, I don't. Lit. I don't pimp out no girls. They do. I don't want you, know you to pimp them out. Just, uh, just find the ones. That, hey, hey, you, you like Jack? You like Jack? You like Jack? But just keep on going. To okay. The ones that say they to like the ones me. say that you like you. Okay. Yeah. Fair enough. Then, I got you. Yeah. They, they don't gotta stay with me all the time. Oh no. Okay. No. You gonna spoil them too? What's spoiling? I mean, <laughs> what, what, what y'all think? What's spoiling? What's, um, what, what's spoiling? Because I pay Hulu bills. Oh, okay. Hulu bills. You know, that's that's I, starting I pay, somewhere. I, I pay um, Disney Plus bills. Okay. okay. You know what I'm saying? I, yeah. I, got, I, I can buy some guest purses. Oh, okay. Some you know guests. I mean, yeah. yeah. yeah that, I got Apple Watches. What what's about, up? What about some coach purses? Coach. Oh, we can do a coach purse. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I don't mind. I don't mind. Hey, and they all like Jack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Some I dinner. Like, I like food, mm-hmm. so I my like food. Oh, right okay, now. okay, shoot. One hundred percent. What kind of food you talking about? I love mm-hmm. all type of food. Zaxby's. Mm-hmm. Uh, more like no. soul food. Italian. Some crab Italian. 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 Some seafood. I like meat, chicken, and salmon. Over here right now. Oh, we definitely gonna eat that. Good. I'm gonna eat that afterwards. But I mean, like, you like going on dates though? Date. Yeah, I like going on a date. <laughs> yeah, yeah. date. What, I know you that? like. What, 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 what is a date? Like, take me out to dinner and we yeah. talk some vibes. Yeah. And it's so, like. So I got to go Grill. out and. Capital like Grill. Grill. I love Capital yeah, Grill. I've never been there. You, been, you, you like Capital Grill? I went there one time. I wasn't really. Mm. You didn't go with a lady? Did you go with a lady? No, I went with a dude. Oh, yeah. So, that's see, why. that's why. Yeah, that yeah, was some bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> then I had a gay waiter, too, and whatnot, and he oh. was too extra. Oh, mm-hmm. shit. Yeah, he was tripping. Damn. So, yeah, next time, you need to go with a lady. Yeah, he want to take a picture with me, too, and his beard was touching my face. Oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> damn. That's all <Yeah>. weird. <laughs> <laughs> right. Stop. 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 Yo, you funny. <laughs> 
Yeah, that's it's true okay. though. When you when you kiss a dude with the no, beard, was, beard. No, not not you. I was like, <laughs> I, I, was face, I was facing my ladies when I said it. Do y'all feel weird like with the beard? No, sometimes? I'm like, not. I don't like it. You like it? I feel like it no. is. Really good I think if it's long, if I like it. But if it's long. short, I don't. Mm -mm, I don't like that long. Mm -mm. You don't like it long. Yeah, she a fuck Cause you need to keep how, it tame. How, 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 how like, yeah, exactly. like a little. Well, you know, like a little. Not like, you know, oh yeah, not like. Crazy. I don't like the hanging. <laughs> yeah, that's I'm just saying, yeah. saying no, like little little studs. Oh yeah, no. I don't like the scruffy. Yeah, no. I don't like scruffy. I can, I can, I can fuck with it. Oh, I can fuck with it. You know, if it, if you look valid. I can fuck with you. Okay. But if you uh, uh, They gotta be full. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Full it gotta be full. It like, gotta be full. So y'all fuck right. with a lot of like uh, You like it thick. Mm. Y'all like, <laughs> like, 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 like them Philly guys then. With the big oh, ass. Yeah, they beard. do be having mm -hmm. well, that's true, they do have some big yeah. old Papa Smurf beards. Mm -hmm. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know. I like everything to be honest, as long as they make me laugh. Just mm. as simple as that. Yeah. Mm. And they got to spoil me, too, though, like a little bit. I'm what, what is spoiled. spoiling? Like, this is like the same I like food. I like food, there. gifts here and there, money every once in a while, yeah. you know. Trips? Yeah. Trips. Yeah. I do like what, trips. What is a trip? Jamaica. They talking about yeah. out the country. They talking about out the country. Jamaica. Or we, go, <laughs> or we go to Vegas. That's how you get trips. We go to Vegas. We, what? Oh, no, we gotta know the people. Oh, yeah. This is how That's you get nice. kidnapped. It. No, we gotta know the person we're going with. We're not going with no random. No stranger. Right. No stranger. Oh, okay. Yeah, no. So how long you got? Yeah, I was just about to ask yeah. that. So, like, how long? I think yeah. a couple months. I'll say no. minimum three. That's a stranger. No. Yeah, that that's fact. I feel like, like if you with them every day, no, it's not. You don't know I mean, nobody at the minimum. You've never been with a nigga every day. <laughs> that's true. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> you're right, my dad. <laughs> okay, like five months. I say I say six, like six and up, like six to What's eight. But out, the country, but out the country, though, it's crazy. I would say, I would say, I would say it depends mm. on the guy. It depends on the guy. Yeah, and it depends on the guy. That's true. It That's true. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. So you, you have y'all in. So you have y'all flown out with guys and um. Out the country. Out the country. Mm. No, I haven't yet. Mm -hmm. No comment. Well, actually, I've been on an island. Okay, but it wasn't. It was the Virgin Islands. Yeah. But it was for business. Actually, it was for um a music video we did with Forty Two Doug and Scarzio. Okay. We flew out like five girls. You weren't doing no virgin shit on that virgin. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Wait. 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 <laughs> But we were done. We definitely did not do no sexual show. It was work. It was work. Modeling. Oh, okay. Yeah, not the other type of work. Hell no. Boy, bye. We was over there modeling. We were a whole music video shoot. Girl, I model with that nigga. Like. Oh my god, that's crazy. I modeled the fuck out that nigga. <laughs> modeling dick. Oh my god. <laughs> Girl, you should have seen me in that dish. Oh, my God. <laughs> that, now, that's crazy. <laughs> Dig, yeah, it is crazy. Yeah, that is crazy. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Have y'all ever got flown out and, um, you know, you, the guy was expecting a little bit more than you was trying to do? And No. I don't do the flying out thing because I don't like people expecting. Expecting. I feel like if somebody fly you out, they kind of expecting something, and I don't mm. need nobody expecting nothing from me. Cause you're yeah. gonna be real sad if I be like, mm. <laughs> you're gonna be like, dang, well I just spent all that money. You feel me? I just flew you out. I just did all that for you know. So mm. I'm, I'm never understand. No man. I mean, if it's, if we're seeing each other already. Oh yeah, that, if we're dating, yeah. then yeah. that's different. That's but if it's some random, it's some mm -hmm. random. Yeah, you know. the guys. Mm -hmm. that, I, I never understood the concept of a guy flying a girl out. That he ain't never had sex with before. Right. Trying to make it. Because they can have money. Right. You're not having. That's true. I think it's just to put on a, like, oh, I got money. I'm going to fly you out. Yeah. But it's like. It'd be the broke one. Right. You get out there and it might be a whole different situation. Sure. And the sex might not be good. Yeah. You ever had some bad sex? I didn't have some bad sex in the same city. I feel you on that. Yeah. Like, what if I got out of town with this? No <laughs> facts. <laughs> yeah, it's a surprise in every box. Mm hmm That's true. Dig, dig, dig. So, I, like, so the, the um, how did you guys become models, and how did y'all mm -hmm. meet Molly? Starting mm -hmm. all the way at the end, coming on down. Okay. Okay. My start was from casting directors that I just met. They kept booking me for different modeling gigs, and then I got into it. Man, you it. better stop acting like you be getting booked <laughs> all the goddamn time. <laughs> I'm just bullshit. 
<laughs> Sorry. And that's how I started. And then I just recently moved to Georgia. I actually mm -hmm. found Molly, and I just started applying to a lot of her you castings. Was on Molly? Yeah, I found, found, found Molly. Molly, yeah. Molly yeah. World yeah. casting. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I found Molly World casting, <laughs> and she has all the opportunities in Georgia. So she's like really connected to everybody. So. She's the one. Yeah, you should. Sure, yeah. yeah, I just cool. booked oh, you for yeah. I booked you for. We did. Be condoms. Oh yeah, be condoms. Shout out to be condoms, a black owned condom, condom company. Condom yeah. Oh, I it was really them. good. They, 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 there you they, go. They work. They work. They work. Mm -hmm. they work. Somebody got pregnant for real. Uh, wait, what? Oh, yeah, yeah. Black owned. Definitely black. Man. You crazy as hell. <laughs> I'm like, huh? We just did the they first Spellman. Right? <laughs> yeah. Gold? No, they well, come in like a silver box. But yeah, yeah. So you must have right. been. Oh, uh, okay. Right. There you yeah, go. Yeah, come in a big. They about the box about this high, and like, they, yeah. You I, thinking I about that. the right? <laughs> <laughs> Is it the right one you talking about? They have all sizes. They got the all right sizes. Yeah, oh, well, I don't, I don't right know. There you go. She like, it was a good one, too. Okay, yeah. I see what you tried to do. You made a pad like that. <laughs> <laughs> you Sorry. think I need a bigger one? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I saw it back there. You better stop serving me. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Cut it out. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Desi, how do you get started? Um, I started... <laughs> Okay, so last year I started doing like just photo shoots and stuff just for myself personally because I'm a YouTuber, so I just wanted to like branch off into Instagram a little bit more. And then you're a YouTube person that want to branch off into YouTube. Like Instagram. you know, just get into different platforms. I was okay. just strictly on YouTube. I did, wasn't on Instagram or Twitter or none of that. We so had some different times. Man. Yeah, so I just started <laughs> doing photo shoots and stuff, and then I wanted to get into like videos and stuff like that. How um, old I are really. You? How old am I? Yeah, I'm 20. I'm about to be 21, November 18th. Oh. 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 I can't wait. I'm mad happy. I'm mad happy. Oh, Finally. What you, what what you gonna do first? Yeah, I, it, it don't even yeah, matter. I don't, I don't even know for real. But I'm gonna I'm take outside. her out. I'm, outside. I'm taking her out. Yeah, period. Y'all heard. Young people are always you outside. Oh, you get inside. <laughs> right, there you go. Yeah, we you outside, outside though. <laughs> but um, I met Molly. Actually, I had a friend who already got who was already into like videos and stuff like that, and I think you cast her for something. So I kind of just submitted for a couple of things and stuff like that. Then I met her, real humble, always at the shoots. You feel me? Like I don't know. I don't all the casting directors I've worked with. I feel like Definitely this one, and then yeah. she's a female, so I feel like she more just makes you feel way more comfortable. comfortable. Very professional. A lot of these men are very unprofessional, and they need to get it together. Yeah. Yeah. But other than that, yeah. Appreciate Shout that. Shout out to her. Appreciate yeah. that. Davina? Um, I started... No, that ain't your name. <laughs> Why? Why? Yeah. Can you see some identification? Yes, I can see some identification. It's not on me right now. I know. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, but I started um, because I would just like get hit up on Instagram by like photographers. Um, hey, ain't nobody hit your ass. Oh, go ahead. Reputable ones. And um, from there, just started shooting there. And with you, I feel like it's been- It's, it's been, been a, a minute. minute. Like two years? Probably two or three years. I don't even remember what was the first. What, do you remember? No, I have no I idea. I book you a lot. Yeah, it's, so I don't know. it's been a long time. <laughs> Definitely the dopest casting director I've ever worked with. Oh, thank you. Um, energy bomb. Mm -hmm. Ass bomb. Right. <laughs> <laughs> energy bomb. Thank you. <laughs> just had to, just had to put that in there. <laughs> what? She'll check it out my ass. What? Apparently, I, I didn't know, but thank you. Oh, I, I thought I was tripping. Now she was, yeah. Okay. But yeah, just all Holy around shit. amazing. Oh, individual. thank you. Yeah. I appreciate that. That's what's up. So when, yeah. when you're uh, casting for ladies, what do you look for, Molly? Um, I look for, first off, professional pictures because why should I pay you if you don't have you know, invested in yourself and with professional pictures. And then secondly, energy, 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 energy. I need positive energy. I need confident energy. I need all the energy. I need no negative energy, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. So, facts. So <laughs> I'm very big on that on set. Don't be like a boring girl or insecure. I'm sorry, but you're getting paid to be on set. Make sure you work the camera how you're supposed to work it. And also, I'll be there to help coach you along the way as well. So, yeah. Now, what, what would you say are some of the biggest obstacles, you know what I'm saying, when it comes to uh, being a female running a modeling service? Hmm, men. <laughs> no, um, but for real, it's a, definitely a male-dominated industry as far as, like, just industry, period, so entertainment world. So definitely I would say, like, being, at least in the beginning, right now it's a little easier for me just because I've 
put my mark on the game, you know, and, like, people really see me doing my thing right now. But I would say, like, men, I mean, every day it hit on me. That's just normal. Um, and then just people would belittling me sometimes because I'm a small white girl doing my thing, you know. So, I don't know. Just that's a struggle for sure, like, men belittling. But... I go through it. I shoot. I don't care if you're a big, tall man and stronger than me. I'm gonna make sure I do business right, and you're not gonna intimidate me. So. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's what's up. For sure. That's what's up, man. And so, can you give me an example of like, or, uh, or a time where things got a little hairy, and what mm -hmm. did you do to get out of that situation? Well, I mean, a lot of times on set, not a lot of times, but there's definitely liquor on a lot of sets, right? And so, definitely. Hip hop artists sometimes get a little too drunk, you know, um, or they're to be honest, it's more so their groupies or their um, entourage that be doing too much. I hate entourage; like they be doing <laughs> way too much. They think they're the, the rapper. I'm like, no, you not. You just a homeboy, bro. Chill out. Um, but sometimes they get too touchy feely or say some crazy shit. Like apparently the other day, I had to go off on somebody um, for saying. To one of my models directly was like, oh, yeah, I would have you sit on my face right now. I'm like, yo, you can't just say that randomly. You just met this girl two seconds ago. Like, and he thought it was a joke. Like, it was funny. I'm like, you can't joke with somebody. If you, they don't even know your, you know, your, how you joke. And it was just too much. Yeah, but she, he don't even know she's my dad. Right. Wait, well, that, I, mean, like, right? <laughs> I mean, that's some real shit, too. But, like, <laughs> still, like, it was just too much, you know. It's very, it's way too much. Yeah, so, like, sometimes I have to step in and be, you know, cock block, for sure. <laughs> like, bro, you cannot say that or do that. Like, I went off on him. So, but, like, that does happen a lot. Well, not a lot, but it happens to a certain extent that I have to say something about it. Like, you know, it's just about respect at the end of the day. You know, like, girls are here, like, at least for a music video, ladies are here to turn you up, make you look good, even if you can't get girls on your own, it makes you look like you can, you know? Or if you can't get girls on your own, either way. But I'm just saying, like, the girls are there to make you look good, so don't be dis disrespecting them. 100%. You know? Hey, hey give me the applause for that one, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta respect the ladies. You gotta sure. respect the ladies mm -hmm. at all times. Now, have you ever uh, had that same situation with women? What do you mean by that? The, like, the same thing with aggressive women towards the women uh, like oh like, oh, a, like woman a woman artist or something or yeah, like a women, woman client women like that, that that might be part of the entourage that were coming on oh yeah no i was on a set one time that she was like bitch you better shake your shit and i was like whoa like chill That's out and then she kept like no you need to do it like like she was like hands on like literally grabbed the girl's ass and was like you need to do it like this. And I was like, whoa, you need to chill out, girl. Like, she going to turn up once the, the song comes on. She's going to do her thing. Like, too much. Because, <laughs> you know, um, I, I, I think Davina had just said this. Um, Remembered your name. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, there you go. <laughs> yeah, I know her name. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, she, she just said, uh, you know, it just makes it more simpler because it's, it's working with females. Mm -hmm. But sometimes females can um, take advantage of being females. Mm -hmm. and that's, right. that's some real shit. It that's definitely doesn't have happen. experienced that, ladies? Um, kind of yeah. at a show yeah, before. Yeah, like being very, trying to like coach you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. As if like, coach, you yeah. see what I'm doing, like why do you feel the need to coach me? Right. Do you notice if it's like more time when they're like drinking? Because I know at least with me, I've seen it more with girls drinking and not just... I would say yeah. definitely more drinking than, like, without yeah. liquor there. Yeah, definitely. For sure. Or, like, yeah. later on when they feel, like, more comfortable. Like, oh, as yeah. the night goes on, it's like, definitely. oh, trying to be buddy-buddy and, like... That's true. They feel like they have, like, some type of authority. Or have you seen it from another model trying to coach you? Has yes. that happened? Yeah. And, yeah. like, when you didn't ask for it? Yeah. yeah. And it's just like... Okay, yeah. Yeah, you yeah, just got to play it cool. Yeah, girl, okay. Not be disrespectful yeah, about it. Because some just, girls, you never know what right. they're going to do. So That's true. How about you, McKay? No, I haven't really gotten that energy, like, when they're drunk, at least. But I have gotten, like, some of the girls, like, trying to coach you on set, like, the director, if it's a female. But never from the guys, really, so. I mean, yeah. if it's a director, that makes sense. Yeah, okay. But if it's done anybody else, it certainly makes sense, too. Yeah. Not the Unless it's models. me on set, I'm coaching y'all, then it's like, because I'm We're saying it for a reason. <laughs> right, yeah, yeah. Not other models, though, no. 
Nike. Um. Dig, dig, dig. So, uh, Molly, do you find that being white is more of an obstacle or just being a female in the game mm. is more of an obstacle? I feel like both, um, especially, like I said earlier, when I started out, for sure, because they're also like, who is this white girl running, you know, doing stuff and everything. But now I feel like I have a lot of respect because I respect everybody at the end of the day. Yeah, you do. And I feel like I get that same respect back. Yeah, you do. Um, I appreciate that. Um, and I, I feel like I really put people on as far as just in their careers and also into money. Like, I have a lot of people who reach out to me. Like, they might just be having a bad month and they really need money, you know. And I'll go out my way to help them find a job or help them find a gig, you know. So I'm really, I really help people and I really want people's dreams to come reality, you know, and I, any way I can make that possible, I try to. So I feel like, yes, me as a white woman definitely is a struggle, but it's like I have all respect for, you know, black culture and everything, and I think they know that as well, so. So you, 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 um, directed music videos and mm -hmm. you, you about to start directing full features yes at least some short films to start and then some features down the line i want to definitely put my short films into some film festivals um i'm working on pre-planning that right now and then um do production next year 2023 we lit 2023 mm -hmm. um surrounded what type of subject matter so i want to do all different stuff but I really want all my short films to have some type of meaning to them that can make you um, think about the world differently or even think about yourself differently so I definitely want to oh this is gonna get a little deep but um, touch on some subjects as far as bullying suicide um, domestic violence and rape I feel like we it's not talked about enough and I feel like um, I could definitely help change that or even help somebody like you know if they were thinking about committing suicide now know not to do that you know have so have you ever been suicidal yeah mm -hmm. growing up um seventh grade you suffer from depression yeah depression and i was um bullied a lot in seventh like in seventh grade and it made me like go into almost sui like suicide for real i did i decided not to and thank god i'm still here i can help people and everything but um yeah like i definitely think it's a subject to talk about i actually made a youtube video at 15 and um about it and i some people watched it and they actually decided not to commit suicide because of it. So I definitely feel like if I did that at 15, think about the impact I could do now at 27 with all my followers and influence I have. Can you share with us like what, what was something that, that made you curve or uh, um, helped you change your mind? Um, yeah, yeah, I thought about my family. I didn't want my parents finding me on a, in a rope around my neck, you know? Um, that's what made me stop. Like, I literally had the rope in my hand and decided not to because I didn't want my family to see me like that. Wow. Yeah. Ladies, have y'all ever felt the same way, starting with you, Michaela? I've never been suicidal before, but, you know, we all have our days. Like, you know, we're not feeling our best, so. But I always go to my family, you know, and they always help me through it, but, yeah. Desi, I'm how do you deal with share. depression? Um, uh, keeping myself busy. Mm, and I feel that one. Just being productive. Um, I went through a depression at one point, but yeah, we're not. Mm -mm, I don't want to get emotional <laughs> on here, but I'm good now. Great now. Better position. It's okay. For sure. It's okay. Um, for me, there was like about like a year or so ago, I went through like a really rough patch. I was like, I was diagnosed with like severe depression and all that stuff and I, with that I decided to like go to a psychiatrist and like get you know get therapy is good therapy yeah, mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. and that really just helped me through it in addition to like just being surrounded by like really good people family friends and yeah for sure mm -hmm. yeah big big mm -hmm. so uh, you all are, are models uh, up becoming models and whatnot what is this is something that you I guys always wanted to be starting mm -hmm. with Michaela no, this is just something I fell into. It's not I something that. I expected to do. I actually have my degree in communications, and I started out as a nursing major, and so I used to, well, I still do. I love biology. I love social media, and I plan on having a business my on my own soon, so, but modeling just, like, 
came into the vision and like I like it, so I'm gonna stick with it too. I feel like right. it. So it's a cool little hobby for you. Yeah, right. Okay. All right. Um, yes. I definitely did not. It's a lot of things that I do that I never thought I would do. I really didn't know what I wanted to do or what I was gonna do. All I knew, like since I was younger, I was gonna be rich, wealthy. <laughs> And like that it. was it. I was yeah. like, I don't Speaking know how it's going to gonna happen, but <laughs> it's going to happen some way. But i always been an entrepreneur. Like, even when I was younger, I literally used to sell bottles of hand sanitizer and lotion with glitter in it. I called it glitter tizer. I was not playing. And it was buying my stuff, too. Okay. So, you feel me? Yeah. Yes. Okay. And I was like, one way. No, 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 no. <laughs> I went and got the stuff from the store, like, you know, the lotion and the, you know, yeah. the hand sanitizer stuff. Attitude. And then, you know, I added the different colored glitters, you know, shook it up, took it to school. And I was like, hey, y'all, you know, I'm selling glitter ties. How old were you? I was, I think I was like in sixth grade. Like, oh, I was yeah. very young. I was just trying to make something shake. I tried to uh, put together a girl group. It was just, I was just doing something. Are you doing a lot of stuff? Something got to shake. You always was a businesswoman? Yes. Like that, entrepreneur? Yes. I feel that. I was not playing. Like, I just always, like, I just knew I wanted to be wealthy. Heavy on the wealthy, not rich. I want to be wealthy. But I just, I don't know, the people around me wasn't wealthy or rich, and they was working regular. So I just knew I wasn't doing that. Like, I don't care. I'm not doing that. But I'm going to figure something out. I started doing YouTube once I graduated, and that is really what helped me a lot like with everything and then once I started doing that now I'm here like how, how much you? would you selling your glitter ties over for I don't know I feel like I think I was selling like ten dollars and like 20 because I had like the big bottles too so the big bottles was like 20 I was like 20 we got 10 we got fives it just depends on the size I had I used to write I like to write so I used to write out like the whole plan and how much everything costs what's the purpose of the business where I'm trying to take it like everything mm -hmm. And yeah, I actually was making money from it. Of course, like in school, they hate people selling stuff. I don't know. They yeah. do not want you to sell stuff at school, but it's like, I'm really trying to get my money. I used to like, sell, I don't know. Um, what's it called? Paper, I would make paper dogs uh -huh. at like, like five years old, no, like origami. Like origami yeah. yeah, like in um pre in oh, not preschool, but in kindergarten through like elementary, like all throughout elementary school, I was mm -hmm. selling those at like young, and then I would sell them on the corner of my house too, and I people would buy them <laughs> like for real. I was I never had a nine to five in my life, never. I've always been oh, doing okay. stuff. <laughs> so you got somebody to buy some some paper yeah paper dogs, dogs. yes it probably was mm. cute and did it move they're cute did it move like yeah, a little bit like the everything. yeah why would some kids buy anything yeah right. but people, no, adults facts. are buying it too yeah that's right for their kids how yep. much was you selling it for that's like a dollar each okay okay but it adds up i would make like 50 at a time that's good. what yeah mm -hmm. i've always been my entrepreneur my mindset Who for sure you to sell it um well my dad is has his own company He's an architect, um, and you look like your dad. <laughs> <laughs> so I've never, I've always grown up watching him be his own boss. So I was like, I'm never working for nobody. I'm gonna be my own boss too. So yeah, yeah, definitely. Oh wow. my god! <laughs> hey, oh, yeah. about, about that glitter ties I got home and that shit was all over my arm. Like, no, nah, you would have liked it. It wasn't, it wasn't too much. It was perfect. It was perfect. Perfect you could get whatever glitter. color you wanted. Like I had the pink, the white, the gold. But still, mm -hmm. I'm a boy. It you was, right. You right. Yeah. But you could have got it for. Uh, you I'd have been me? walking around glistening everywhere. <laughs> I was, you know, you can't. You can't go to basketball practice. Right, you know, with the glitter, glitter all over you. You right. You right. So, Davina, you always wanted to be a model. Actually, yes. I wanted to do modeling like ever since like I was a kid, and my mom would be like, "No, focus <laughs> on school." You know, typical you know African mm -hmm. parent mentality. So I kind of like gave up on it. Um, like, I always wanted to do it. Like, I wanted to, like, I loved fashion and all that stuff, but I was like, ugh, with my mom and my parents, I'll just do school, blah, blah, blah. So then I got again to college, and it's like, college, your parents aren't there. You can do whatever you mm -hmm. want, you know? Mm -hmm. so, then, <laughs> <laughs> so then, like, while, you know, pursuing my degree, that's when I started modeling, and I'm here today Turning with my up. degree. Perfect. Yeah, so, graduated. Yeah, I graduated early. Hey, graduated early. Graduated early. Graduated early. Graduated early. You graduated this year? Yeah. Okay. We got smart girls over here. Yeah, what's your degree? <laughs> Marketing. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's a yeah. great. That's a great. That's hot. That's hot. So, mm -hmm. like, what you was gonna do with that marketing degree? Um, really like social media, like marketing. And what you kind of using right yeah. now? And you can use it with your because of um, you know, 
the uh, the new gig I got you. She's a celebrity assistant right now yeah. and doing okay. marketing for her. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. So, like, what all have, uh, have you casted for? And what all do you Ooh. cast? So, I cast a lot of different things. Um, I cast from hair campaigns to music videos to um, commercials to TV shows to films to events to really everything and anything. Uh, we cast models and actors. We also cast kids. We cast men and women. Wow. Um, wow. All ages. Mm hmm. <laughs> How many um, models do you think that you have? Oof. I think I have over a thousand. Cause, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think over a thousand um, for sure because, no, definitely over a thousand because I've casted over thousands of music videos and a lot of commercials and a lot of shows. Um, all over the country. I don't just cast in Atlanta. You know, I'm from Marietta. Ooh, ooh. Um, I'm a Georgia <laughs> Peach. But I do cast all over the country and outside the country as well. So, yeah. I can dig it. Mm-hmm. That's what's up. That's what's for up. sure. Well, I, I think that I, um, uh, I had seen you casting like for, uh, was it a, a pizza commercial or whatnot? Oh, I did a hot dog commercial for the Atlanta airport. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm like, damn, Molly moving like that. Yeah, definitely. I also did a this super- ain't just about music. <laughs> <laughs> no, I also casted for the Super Bowl commercial for when it was in here in Atlanta. Um, I casted for the airport, the whole like commercial for it. Which was really cool, um, as well. Mm-hmm. That is That's crazy. I've done it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What about reality shows? Um, I've definitely helped on a lot of reality shows, like when they need background for a lot of stuff, and then also helping people get on reality shows as well. Um, I try to stay away from it a little bit because it's like a lot of setup shit. You know, like reality shows, the producers always set you up for something. So I try not to be on the shows as much. And I always warn everybody that gets on reality to be like, be aware of that. Um, But I like, you know, narrative more like TV shows and movies. So are you saying that you casted somebody? Mm-hmm. On you helped cast somebody on a reality show or something they got their ass whooped. Well, to to not like you. that, no. But like, <laughs> <laughs> no. But I've definitely seen like reality, like, like really fuck up people's lives. You know, yeah. like loving hip hop. Like a lot of those people get, yeah. Molly Wild. No, I don't. I don't <laughs> set them up. I only book the background. They don't do anything. They just sit there and laugh. You know, but. No, I'm talking about I've seen like my friends that are on reality show like it in some situations. So like, yeah, yeah. So what, I try to warn people. <laughs> what's, what would you say is one of the biggest misconceptions about Molly World? Mm, that I just cast models between the age of 18 to 28, which I do cast mostly. Like I would say probably like 80 percent of my gigs are like that. But I do cast everything. Like I just said, like TV shows, movies, everything, hair campaigns. ORS, ORS Hair Care, Olive Oil Brand, they probably would like y'all's hair for sure. They like natural hair. And they also do wigs as well. Um, but I do, th- I've been casting for them for like four years. I do their billboards across the country, like from in Times Square to LA to everywhere. Um, we also do like their marketing campaigns and also hair shows. So I cast literally everything when it comes to you, what you could cast for. Mm. So yeah. Is there anything that you you uh, you cast before that you were like kind of surprised? Like, damn, I did that <laughs> for sure. I mean, I just got hit up from some law firm um, to just book some actors for their commercial they have coming up. They have a big seminar with like five thousand um, lawyers, and they wanted me to cast some actors for that. Which I was like, that's a random situation, but I like it, you know. Mm-hmm. And th- that corporate check hits different, <laughs> okay. you know, for sure. Okay, I like it. And, that. like, somebody randomly asked me to book a wolf for them for a video. A wolf? Yeah, a wolf. And I found them a wolf. You yeah. found a wolf? A live I found, wolf? Yeah, a live, yeah, a real wolf. Yeah. There's actually a wolf um, sanctuary out here in Georgia. You can oh, book. Wow. Yeah. I didn't know that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so I get asked, I get called for the most random stuff. <laughs> and that's the most random thing somebody ever uh, wolf, uh, asked you for? Um, tiger. I guess a tiger, too. Yeah. Snakes. I have lemurs too. Well, I don't have them. I have a company that I work with that has all those different types of animals um, that we book. 
So yeah. Mm-hmm. You saw some of them at my party. Yeah, that was kind of crazy. Yeah, <laughs> we. <laughs> I thought it was fake at first. Yeah, we had lemurs, snakes, parrots. Yeah. Yeah. I was sitting in, the, in your party like this. <laughs> You're like, please don't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, that was kind of nuts. It was lit, though. You know, it was super lit. Mm-hmm. And you had them things. I had a too. lot of models out there. I yeah. had a, some strippers out there. It was lit. Yes, I, mm-hmm. love, I love strippers. Yeah, we had girls that were body painted like mm-hmm. animals. Yes, it was a jungle theme, so that's why we had everything jungle theme. Yes. Mm-hmm. They, they, they were very bodacious. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's a good word for it. One hundred percent. Um, you had this thing online, mm-hmm. this uh thing where it was you and Boozy. Oh yeah, Boozy. Mm-hmm. Boozy was one of my there. major clients. <laughs> a fool on there. What, what, what was that? Oh, the one that was on Shade Room. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so Boosie flew me and two girls out to Colorado to shoot his movie, which is actually dropping very soon. It's super funny. Oh, we got a new movie? Yeah, it's a new movie coming out. Uh huh. Um, I think it's coming out like next month. I need to double check, but uh, be on the lookout for it. But there's a scene in there that I'm in it and two girls are in it that were like all supposed to look like we're high. And so we were out there and these guys, we, so we went bowling right, right when we got there. And these guys had a house, and they're like, you can use this for, you know, your movie if you want to. Um, yo, they had weed, they had shrooms, and Boosie was like, I've never done shrooms before, let's do it. So, yo, <laughs> he took this shroom, and he made, well, he made all his people take it, and then he asked my models if they wanted to, which they did. I didn't do it, and the director didn't do it, but everybody else was on shrooms. And, yo, when I tell you it hit them an hour later... And he started driving, and he started, y'all see this video, you saw the video with him, like, with his leg in the air, and he's driving and stuff, yeah, yeah that's the video that I took of him, um, and he was high off his ass, bro, and he was tripping, and then we went to, we went to the, um, the, um, what's it called, like, those, those big puddles of water, not puddles, but the springs, the hot springs, we was the hot springs, and he bought all those tickets to get there, and then he bought his bathing suits to go. It was super dope. And then we went in there. They're all high, yo. He goes, and there's literally, they're the only black people there. And then all these white people. And he's all like, my neighbors. And he like, yo, he was <laughs> wildin', yo. It was so crazy. It was so much fun. And we went in there. And then at night, I can't say what happened at night, but it just, it was lit at night. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody was getting into something out there. It was like, lit. <laughs> holy <I'm> a- <laughs> cow. <laughs> holy cow. Ain't no party like a boozy party. No, and he invites me all the time whenever he's doing a party at his house. It'd be lit. <laughs> it'd, be, it'd be take your page down lit. It'd be uh, sometimes, yeah. It definitely gets a little lit for sure. Wow. Topless pool parties. Yeah. Wow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you, you took the girls there? I don't, I don't think I've taken any of y'all there, no, yet. no, but I've taken some, I, <laughs> 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 it'd be lit, it's, it'd be different, it'd be different vibes, not all the time it's, okay, not all the time it's topless, y'all, sometimes it's just a good vibe, for sure, okay, mm-hmm, yeah, yeah, wait until she turns 21. <laughs> she excited to turn 20 at one I'm so for excited. sure. I am. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she said, We're going to Boosie House. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to Boosie House. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I want to go to Mardi Gras. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, that's a lot of fun. Wait, when is that? When is Mardi Gras? I don't know. February. Yeah, February. We should do a trip. Babe, yeah. I'm going to be mm-hmm. up Get some beads. Oh, yes. I'm going to be up This sounds like a scary movie. <laughs> I'm going to be your age. Oh, it's going to go crazy. Yes. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's kind of nuts. That's kind of nuts. Yo, uh, uh, Molly World, man, you know I, I'm going to need you on my show and whatnot, man. I need it. So this is what I need. What do you need? I need some some some, some co-hosts. Okay. Right? So this is what I'm looking for. I'm looking for some, of course, I told you I like strippers. Mm-hmm. You also said you like big booties. <laughs> yeah, so we, yeah. Uh, we, we're building a brand new set for New Jack Thriller City. We're putting the stripper pole up okay. and mm-hmm. whatnot. So, yeah, we need the, the stripper tight okay. and everything, you know. They're going to twerk, too? They're going to just vibe or they're going to also go on the pole? Man, they, it's optional. Okay, <laughs> okay, I like that. It's optional. <laughs> so, you got to throw some money? Yeah, we, we, yeah 100%. Okay, yeah, 100%. okay. 100%. 
And uh, we, uh, we're gonna, uh, yeah, yeah. We, 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 I want them to, to like co-host the show with me and everything. Mm-hmm. When I bring, you know, certain like R&B singers on and stuff like that. Right. So it's, more, it's more of an eye candy slash, mm-hmm. you know, co-hosting thing. Okay, you know, let's do it. You think you can help me out? I can definitely like help you out with that. Let's do it. Yeah, Go yeah. down my roster. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 We need that good energy. Good, perfect energy. Mm-hmm. And not another group, not no groupy shit either. Yeah, I got, no no, I, I got you. I got yes, you. They need to yes. know how to control themselves. Yes. I got you. Yeah, they been somewhere before. <laughs> yes, exactly, <laughs> for sure. I yes. got you. Need, need that. Yeah, we're gonna figure that out and whatnot. Um, yeah. Um, Molly. I, if your life was a movie, what would it be called? Molly World. Welcome to Molly World. Okay, who would you, who would you get to play you? <laughs> ooh, ooh, I've never been asked that question. I don't know. Um, maybe Emma Roberts or somebody? Yeah, she's Emma cool. Stone. Or Emma Stone. Stone. I was Emma Stone. Emma Stone. <laughs> Emma Stone. Oh, yeah, because she's goofy. I'm goofy, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe Emma Stone, that'd be cool. For sure, oh, for sure, for sure. Mind? The um, redhead. Um, I'm trying to think. Oh yeah, wait, yeah, no. Yeah. She's yeah. in a lot of stuff. Yeah, Easy A. Easy A. Yeah, yeah. she's in Easy A. She's in a lot of stuff. She's in what? Easy A. You never seen that? You never seen that? Spider-Man Two. Oh, yeah, oh yeah, it's it was, Spider-Man um, Two. Gwen Stacy. Yeah. Yeah. I don't I'm know. So confused. I need to I need to figure <laughs> it out. I need to figure out some. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. Facts. Well. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, if, if somebody my age know the shit they talking about, you better watch out for him. What? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to take their word for them and just catch up. But, but I don't know. I don't know what the fuck they talking about. Watch out for that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How long have you been a comedian for? Uh, since I was 17 when I went to go see Kings of Comedy at Phillips Arena. Oh, okay. Back when it was called uh, State for, uh, when State Farm Arena was... um. Phillips yeah, yeah, definitely. Long, long. Oh, that's right. You're from Atlanta. Yeah, I'm from here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, that's how long I've been there. Okay. Yeah, been that's awesome. That. Yeah, uh, me and Lil Duval, we all started at the same time. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. He's good people, too. He's so funny. Really, really, really great guy. <laughs> and he's very humble. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Super humble. Mm-hmm. Then, uh, you know, went on to do a wildin' out in 2012. Mm-hmm. You know, with my guys, DC, Carlos, and uh, Chico. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, here we are now. One Facts. The new, new Jack Thriller City on 85 South. Hey, turn up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, um, been doing this for a long time. A long time. But we also, we both started as teenagers. Yes, at teenagers. Mm-hmm. That's, and I mean, that's when you know, no, and you know, it sounds like, you know, the ladies have the same mm-hmm. thing. So, you know, y- y'all off to a great start. I'm really excited for y'all. And I already know it's going to happen just the way you want it to. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Everything happens for a reason. Mm-hmm. So, big believer in that. Word, word, word. So, tell me, man, what's ne- what's next for you, man? And uh, well, let's go down the line. You want to start from here and then come on back yeah, down? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, let's talk to Michaela what's real quick. Next? Okay. <laughs> so, aside from modeling, I also do acting. So, I want to get into that as well and be in some films. And then, of course, communication, starting my own marketing business as well for social media. So. Am. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you got to join my guy, uh, Dwayne Boyd's acting class. I don't know if you're in acting class already. Someone actually told me about that. It's right yes. next door. Oh, oh there you go. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> got it. Um, what's you said? What's um, what coming next? up for? What's next? Okay, <laughs> what's next? <laughs> Let's see what's next. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. Um, what's next? Okay, so I do want to start a clothing brand for petite girls. That's that's what I'm working on right now. Cause I just feel like we just need some love right um, now. You know, we just need some. You know. Hold so, on, you don't feel like petite girls get enough. No, love? No, I'm not saying they don't get enough love, but like I go in the store, I'm trying to find me a small. I'm not. Yeah, the I don't see a small. And then the small well. is like a medium yeah, large. I go you in the store. Me? All it is is shit for petite girls. Really? What? <laughs> 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 what I can't get shit. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Well, we don't shop at the same stores, so I. I'm not sure what what you mean by that, <laughs> but um, yeah, that um, I'm trying to get I'm getting back um, being consistent on my YouTube channel. I did you know slack off a little bit, but it's okay. We we back rolling. Okay. And um, yeah, I'm finally gonna be of age, so it's just a lot of things that I'm just excited. Twenty one, twenty one. Y'all don't even understand. So like a lot, 
y'all she just stay tuned. She can't. I, I, <laughs> no, it's just I a long time. Cause, <laughs> <laughs> no, I already, I, I already do that. Wait to pay taxes all the time. I already do all that. More responsibility. I already do all that. Okay. It's just you know. What 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 are you so excited? Tell me. It's just. Grown, she, what is this? this no, this it's not even about? about. It's not even about like me Could being be outside and having fun because I still be outside. You well, there are. No, no, we we know we get outside. I still be outside. There are certain gigs you can't do unless you're 21. I can't be until. I'm 21, That's true. You know, like what? More. I mean, you can't host a club. You can't do a couple of these music videos unless you're 21. Like, there's certain stuff you can't do unless you're 21. It's a lot of stuff you can't do, but mm -hmm. you're of age, so I said so you can do a lot of things. <laughs> so you don't understand what I mean. Should have paused right you there. I mean? <laughs> 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 I did. I did. I did. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. they don't be really tripping too much, really. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you feel me? A lot of things probably done changed. You feel me? You probably could have got away with a lot of things. I wasn't. I wasn't. Oh, I yeah, she wasn't, wasn't here. Thought. She wasn't even here. She wasn't even here. Wasn't. I'm here now, though. Hell no. She's here now, though. <laughs> I'm here now. Okay, Davina. That's all that matters. Come on, let's talk about something. Huh? Yeah. You was born in 2002? No, I was born in 2001. November 18, 2001. It's the same. No, it's, no, it's not. That's a whole year difference. Yeah. I mean. 2001. I mean, you know. Mm. Dang, that really is kind of. Yeah. Mm. Right. yeah I was right. a 95 baby, okay? Right. I didn't even Shoot. think about it like that, but. Mm. 2001. 2002. You were? Yeah, my birthday was in April. Oh, so that's yeah, why. See, that's she of crazy. age. You see, <laughs> of age is just a crazy like. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's funny. She's <laughs> <laughs> not twenty one. I, yeah. I, I feel horrible just talking to your age. <laughs> 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 like, like drinking <laughs> age. Okay. Yeah, say, you guys say okay. Drinking age. Drinking age. Drinking age. You guys say drinking age. Drinking age. Yeah. We'll do it like that. You definitely not under eighteen. Right. Oh yeah, I'm not age. I'm of age. I'm just yeah. not drinking, yeah. drinking age. age. Yeah. There we go. There you go. Just, just to make it feel a little bit more comfortable for you. Yeah. Davina. 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 What Next. you got coming up? Yeah, right. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. <laughs> just wait. Right. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Nobody clipped that. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm weak. <laughs> but um, what's next for me? Um... <laughs> well, I'm currently working on a book. Oh, I write poetry, so I'm trying to make a poetry Okay, about you. I thought you were about to say you're about my, I'm a book about my life. Oh. <laughs> Do you have one by yours? 20 years. I'm 20 years. Crazy. <laughs> I mean, you never know. 21. Right. She has 21. 21. 21. She has 21. Yeah, my, yeah. I was about to say, of <laughs> drinking <laughs> age. Yeah. You know? Um, oh, goodness. So that, much experience. Um, <laughs> Trying to start a podcast with my friends. Oh, so okay. that's you know still to be disclosed. Not too much on the details yet. Yeah, you um, don't like to talk about shit. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta keep this on the low. You, know. you don't know people are watching. The yeah. birds are chirping. Exactly. <laughs> but other than that, just doing more modeling, booking more shoots, and um, yeah, pretty much it. That's what's yeah. up. Okay. Me, myself, and I. Guy, um, uh, <laughs> um, I got a lot of stuff coming up. I got, I'm definitely gonna be, you know, directing some short films with some scripts. I'm definitely looking for looking for some more scripts to scout. Um, and I'm excited to also be able to book my talent for things, um, acting and modeling. If models want to get into acting as well, um, and you know, in Atlanta. A lot of our gigs are last minute, so mm -hmm. you never know what I got going on tomorrow. Um, I have a lot of weeks that are completely cleared, and then by the end of it, I had a, like five get bookings that day, so each day. So I'm excited to see what you know God has planned for me. So, yeah. Molly, believe in God. I do. I'm Jewish. <laughs> so yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Yeah, I'm Jewish. I, Turn up. <laughs> Oh, I'm not gonna speak on that. <laughs> <laughs> would you? Would you? Let me ask you the last question about that. Mm. Would, would you catch his new videos? Probably not. No. no. Okay. Probably not. I can dig it. I yeah. Dig it. Mm hmm Now, what's what's something about you, Molly, that people would be surprised to know? Mm. 
I don't know. Hidden talents. Are you a gamer? I Do don't. Do you make quilts? No, I can't. <laughs> I, I love camping. Camping? I, yeah, I love camping. You mm -hmm. like a camper? Yep. <laughs> 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 I can definitely see you <laughs> camping your ass. We might do a cabin trip soon. I don't know. That, that, sounds, that sounds like fun. Yeah. That does mm -hmm. sound like, yeah, you tell me about it. If I, <laughs> if I do it, I'll probably have like 20 girls. We all, you know, take some pictures and have a good time. Go by the campfire and stuff. As fun as that sounds, uh -huh. I'm going to take your word for it. You're not going to come? Nah, it just sounds dirty. Mm. <laughs> dirty? <laughs> I mean, a cabin's a little bit different than camping camping is a little messy for sure but it sounds so messy <laughs> a cabin trip though it sounds like, like fun oh you can't and... you don't think you can survive in the woods N no oh i definitely couldn't no I no oh, no no mm -hmm. oh well i'm a survivor oh, i'm 40. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, so, so like in a tent in a tent though not like in the woods but yeah, it's still that's like in the yeah. woods though. I don't think well, yeah, I can do the tent. But you're inside of like a tent. Yeah. But it's still like in the woods yeah. on the floor <laughs> and in the like <laughs> branches if and the in the leaves. Don't be yeah. in the mm -hmm. Honestly, mm -hmm. it's the, anim the, the bomb animals. Y'all scared. Yeah. The bugs. I'm scared. Mm -hmm. You can do like oh. bonfires. Like, it's, it's fun. I actually. Okay, like so she's possible. Yeah. I, 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 <laughs> yeah. I haven't seen too many Halloween movies and too many oh. Jason movies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Facts. And it is Halloween time. Are you going to be anything for Halloween? Oh, I'm yeah. gonna be responsible for Halloween. Oh, I like that. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna be a nigga paying bills on Halloween. I like okay. that. Oh, that is true. Yeah, mm. that's what I'm gonna be. Damn. I'm yeah. responsible, man. <laughs> <laughs> no one can pay more bills than me. <laughs> <laughs> no, fine. I'm gonna be a grown ass man on Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. What if you I'm actually had a shirt saying responsible? Not for real. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I like what? that. What if you had a shirt saying responsible? Yes, yeah, yeah. There right. we go. Mm -hmm. now, uh, my, my cutoff hour, though, for real, is like 9 p.m. 9 p.m. I'm not coming outside. Mm. People get killed outside. That's true. <laughs> yeah. Especially recently. Yeah, man, listen, they get killed on regular days. Yeah, during the daylight so now. I'm pretty sure. Mm. On Halloween. Yeah, you're right. Halloween's yeah. gonna be crazy. I didn't even think about that. You're it right. On a Monday too. Yeah. It is on a Monday. Yeah. But this weekend though. Oh, this yeah, weekend we go. Everybody up. just be safe out here. Yep. Any everybody streets. be safe. It's real dangerous. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, it is, yeah. Uh go ahead. It's gonna be the straight up grand theft auto. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm looking scared. I'm like, look, <laughs> should I go out? Look, <laughs> should I stay home? Hey, make sure you don't have no valuables in your cars because you know they be breaking into all these cars oh, out yeah. here. Don't drink Shoot. and drive. Mm -hmm. Be aware mm -hmm. of your surroundings. Don't smoke and drive. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't. I don't smoke. So I mean, shoot. I just come drink. on. And I don't even drive. I get driven. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I Uber. I Uber everywhere. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm with you on that. I'm on the passenger side of my right. best friend's ride. Right? See, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> and y'all be smoking and driving over there? No, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't smoke, smoke and drive. Maybe smoke and then afterward, you know. You be, I have before. You be high mm -hmm. driving. No comment. You, you drive better when you have? I don't say it's better. I would say it's the same. It's about the same? Yeah. Mm. Okay. Okay. Definitely do not drink and drive. Do yeah, not drink, drink and drive. drive is crazy. That's crazy. That's the. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. And you know what's funny about this conversation, right? Is that I remember when I was coming up. Mm -hmm. um, you know, this is this is uh, over twenty five years ago. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, um, I don't think none of y'all was here. I was. I was two years yeah, old. Used to. <laughs> <laughs> but they used to have these commercials, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> of these like little white boys. You know, um, <laughs> inside a car smoking. <laughs> they had commercials like that? Yeah, they, had, it was, they smoking their hands off. <laughs> they smoking weed and shit. And then they, um, they shit just get out of control. And they, they hit a dude on the bike or hit a, 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 a lady and with a, uh, pushing a straw. Oh. A stroller? That's dramatic. Yeah, that's dramatic that, as hell. Yeah, that's that's what it used that, They was having a good time. Hey, do y'all yeah. remember that? It's supposed to scare them. Yeah, that's what it's made for, for sure. Like yeah, I'm too scared. They happen. Yeah, that actually happened. Damn. Now, now weed is so, it's so, uh, it's legalized and it's so normalized mm -hmm. and whatnot. And, um, you know, it's... It's uh, it's cool to just to hear y'all be say, hey, hear y'all say like times is really, really. Yeah, they have changed for sure. Yeah, 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 I think that's really cool. Still don't drink and drive though. That's yeah. not gonna change. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, definitely don't don't drink and do a lot of shit. 
That's true. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Drink in the house. Drinking yeah. makes you do some crazy shit sometimes. Oh, yeah. Back to go thriller. Jack Thriller, Moni Snaker. Hey, so, um... It's about that time. I really wish that we had more time to do this. And I know this ain't going to be the last time in Molly. Like I said, we got some things that we got to mm-hmm. do. We got a whole lineup. Yes. Mm-hmm. 100%. Hey, um, is there anything that you guys want to tell the people of New Jack Thriller City before we get up out of here, man? Give them your social media. Tell them where they can find y'all. Mm-hmm. Okay. My social media is Michaela Loren, M-I-K-A-Y-L-A-H-H-L-A-U-R-E-N. Uh... Make sure you guys um, follow all my social media platforms and subscribe to my YouTube channel at Desi and D-E-S-E-Y-A-N-N. Make sure to follow me on Instagram at the Davina Sinclair, T-H-E-D-A-V-I-N-A-S-I-N. That's how I know that ain't your name. <laughs> she like, she honestly, know how to spell that. <laughs> honestly, it's spelled how it sounds. The Davina Sinclair on Instagram and TikTok. Yeah. And I'm um, Molly World Casting on Instagram. I don't think I need to spell that out. It's pretty simple. Molly with a Y, not an I. And if you want to follow me and see a little more of me personally on Instagram, it's so official, Molly World underscore. Yep, yep, yep. Because my other one got deleted, so you know. Yeah. yeah. Well, there it is, man. Molly World Casting, man. We over and we out of here. New Jack Thriller City, man. We'll see y'all next time. Wiz, take us Peace. out, baby. Okay. What's this? What's up, bro?